Wait, you want me to do what? You, you want me to go find a job? For what? In this school? Babe, I'm not working. I'm not going in this uncomfortable call to go find no job to work. When summertime comes, I can try. I can get a summer job. But I'm not getting out there in that call. I'd rather stay home, cook, clean, and do all the laundry, do all the wifey duty. I'm the wife. Kick my legs up when it's time to play. Mommy and daddy play, we play. Yes, other women, not Faye Nelson. Not Faye Nelson. Other women can work because they want to work. I, I don't need to work. I'm just comfortable. No, I'm not going to work. Yes, that's when I was single. I used to work and support myself until you, my Prince Charming, came and made me your wife. I'm your ribs now, so you take care of me. You didn't know this is how it's going to be? So tell me, every wife in this world, you think every wife in every marital home work? Okay, if you're not saying that, then what are you saying? I I'm the type of, why didn't you ask me this question before you got married to me? If I wanted to be the type to work. I want to be the type to do it, exactly what I'm doing. Stay at home so my man can take care of me. The bill's too much. Make, it, make, make ends meet. Make ends meet and cross, cross over each other. Build some wealth. Figure it out. It's your job. Why are you acting like God they didn't assign this as your duty in the book of Genesis? Eh? God said he was going to rule over women. You think you will be lazy and rule over women? Okay, you pick the woman, me, that you want to rule over. That means you, you are now my provider. Hmm? If you rule ruling over me, you got to provide all my needs. Ah, you can't rule over me, not get nothing now. Huh? And they tell me to work. I'm not working. I don't care if, to, if, if this is the 220 whatsoever century. I'm not going to work. <laughs> yeah, okay, yeah. Yeah, I know some of my friends stay home and do things to earn money. Have you helped me to venture into that direction, entrepreneurship, and figure out something that I can do from home? No, you're just talking, just talking. I'm not going out in that code. You understand me? Y'all on a duty... God, when God cursed all of us, including the snake, God said that you are going to suffer. You are going to sweat and suffer before we eat. God said all of us, you will suffer and sweat before we eat. And then when God cursed me, the woman, he said, I will suffer before I bear a child. So let's come to, 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 to let, let, let's come, let, let, let's try to be fair about this. Hmm? Your own suffering is for you to work hard, sweat, for you to provide hmm? for this family now. Hmm? But my own suffering that God said I will suffer before I bring children into the world. You, do, you help, do you help me when my own suffering? Do you bear my suffering when I'm suffering? My own suffering that I suffer when I bear a child. Do you, do you bear some of that pain? Do you bear some of that suffering? You see? It's my one, it's only me that go through the suffering, my own curse. So you want me to help you with your own curse that God gave you. Well, time for me to, to bear and endure and go through my own suffering. You don't help me that my one can be there pushing the baby. My one going through all the labor pain. When I come from there, I'm in pain. My metabolism, everything, every, every stress, every strain, every changes. Physically, eh? psychologically, emotionally, internally, eh? going through that by myself. There's no way, no how you can help me with my own suffering, my own cost that God gave me. So for you to take charge of your own cost and, and be responsible of your own cost, be accountable for your own cost, you're telling me to go sweat with you and suffer for all of us to eat. No, that's your duty that God gave you. Go read, go read the Bible. From cover to cover, it's your job. If you don't want a wife, 
then just file for divorce. I'll go back to taking care of myself until another prince charming come who will suffer. And I've had three children for you that you help me with my own suffering. Eh? That God cost me. You helped me. You didn't help me. You're not being fair. Yes, that's how it is. That's how it is. It's about time we be telling you guys the truth. Because when we go in our delivery room, y'all don't, y all y'all do is hold our hand, kiss us. Ah, it doesn't do anything now. You are there, but you're not, you're not taking the pain away. Epi, what? <laughs> After the epidural wear off, see, something wrong with you. Something is definitely wrong with you. The epidural can be there from the start. And after we leave the hospital, the ep epidural can still be there when we're going through pain. Okay, how about the women who after they have babies and go home? They can develop complications. And some of them, when they get taken to the hospital, they even die from those complications. Yeah? Epidural can be part of that. When they are dying, when they develop complications and they are dying, you can lay down and die for them. You are the men. You can lay down and die for them. No. So stop telling me to go to work, please. I'm highly offended that you want me to go to work. Very highly offended that you want me to go to work. Your income should cover me. It should cover you. It should cover everything. Don't, don't ever ask me that question again. When summertime comes, I feel like working, I will work. And my late money, I'm not helping to pay no bills. This is your duty that God gave you. This is your curse. Bear it and be proud of it. It's, it will never leave you. You will forever suffer for us to eat. Hmm? You will so, forever suffer for us to eat. I will forever suffer to bear a child. That you don't help me with. So don't expect me to help you with yours. If I work at all, it will be my own money. I will do whatever I want to do with it. I'm not sharing it with you. Like I said, if you don't want a wife, don't get married. But once you pick on that duty now, you provide everything. You carry the burden. You carry the cross. You carry the load. Eh? You carry everything. Because when it's time for, when, when I'm going through childbearing, you don't help me. So, please. I, I'm, I'm very, I'm, you're the one who, who being unreasonable. I'm reasonable. You, you're the one being very unreasonable. You understand me? Look, I, I was warming food to eat. Please don't disturb me, man. I love you. <laughs> See you when you come from work.